No problem. I'm happy. Listen. All right. I told y'all. See the grease? Probably not the most classy thing. The other thing that just popped out. Probably what y'all, most of y'all was discussing. I don't care. Y'all in my house. It's not the most cleanest environment right now. But I'm in my living room. I'm going to show y'all something. See it? That's the duck that I was telling y'all about. She hooked it up. And let me tell y'all something. It's, it's, it's succulent. It really is. Salty. Greasy, but not too much. I got me a cup of hot tea to go with that because you got to push that grease down. But yo, we bought the munch. Now, I know what you're thinking. You got that garlic mashed potatoes? Nah. Yo, you got some, some nice all burned rice? No. Some wild rice? Absolutely not. You see, I, I'm old school. I'm a true believer in sticking with what works. So, I don't want y'all to judge me. Because I'm eating my duck with grits. That's right. Duck and grits. You know you're, you never did that before in your life. Maybe from the country. And if y'all did, give me a shout out. But I'm going to tell y'all something. I'm going to get back to this. Y'all holding me up. So, I'll talk to y'all. Hold on. I'm not going to lie to you. I totally forgot about y'all yesterday. I, I was supposed to finish that video. Couldn't do it. I was eating. Let me tell you something, yo. That duck that y'all saw on my Instagram, yo, my wife put it down. She did. And um, I finished it off last night. I, I, don't try to judge me. Don't try to play me. All right? It is what it is. Okay? I showed y'all the piece I had. I was being modest. And my son tapped it. Oh, you got too much fat. This dude is the weirdest dude. He don't eat nothing with a bone in it or fat, but he eats meat, which is weird. He makes it work for him. My daughter, oh, dad, I was going to eat the duck, but what the heart it was, was that I saw some dog TikTok and I can't do it. Sound like Louis Farrakhan. And then, don't get me started on my wife. Just want me to make a tortilla out of anything. Yo, she go in there. Slices up some duck, makes a tortilla out of it. Or oh, a sandwich with cheese. How you put duck and cheese together? But she made it work. You know, last night, after I made sure everybody was good, I thought I, I had to think about a scripture to make myself feel better. You know, I think the scripture go, all things are lawful, but not all things are advantageous. Don't ask me where that is, because I can't tell you right now. I just know it. But you know, it was lawful for me to eat the rest of that duck. But it wasn't to my advantage. However, I was still under calories and I still had a great workout in. Shout out to Miles. So I felt better about myself. But um, yeah, it was good. It really was. I ain't gonna lie to you. I'm waiting. I want her to make another one, but I haven't earned it yet. So I gotta go like 21 days. On um, March 21st, she will be making me another duck, but it's okay. I'm in my living room. I didn't clean up yesterday. Y'all get over it. Uh, I'm eating my breakfast now. I made more grits. You know, when you had duck and grits, it spoils you because then you feel like you're somebody special. So I had duck and grits. I got toast and grits now, and I feel like I'm part of the lower echelon, part of the earth. I, I don't know. Uh, but anyway, um, I got my orange. Yo, last season oranges, they were horrible. I couldn't get an orange that was good last season to save my life. But this year, it's early in the game. And I cracked one yesterday. Let me tell you something. That, that, that thing was so delicious. I had my thigh shaking. I'm like, yo, this is good. So I'm going for a round two today. Uh, what am I eating? I'm not telling y'all. I'm just kidding. I just told you, right? Great. See you. However, y'all may not appreciate this. And y'all may think, yo, that's why you fat now. Because you're eating like this. I don't eat like this often. I'm not allowed to. But I had some grits. And I went southern on them. My granddaddy used to make this. Shout out to Bubba. He ain't here though. See that? What is that? Fat back. Anybody who knows about fat back knows that grits and fat back with some toast. That's a southern kind of breakfast. I mean, a breakfast. Excuse me. Uh, the only thing more southern than that is eating grits with macaroni gravy. But I, I, I don't know. Just grits and gravy. Just some, I don't. And people are like, yo, get that ribeye gravy. No. I leave my grits with cheese and butter. I'm good with that. But I did do something different, and it's wonderful. Don't, don't tell nobody. I put a little duck fat in the grit water, and I whipped it together, and they gave it an amazing flavor. People fry french fries in duck fat, so I said, let me give it a shot. 
You know what? I'm probably not gonna make it by morning. I'll, I'll probably be dead by morning. But anyway, um, yeah. So um, we we home today. Um, oh, you see all my plants? I, I'm gonna give y'all a tour about that another time. But look at them. I gotta get those girls over there. My wife got some picture frames over there. We gotta put those back up. We did a paint job, mind you. You would never know it. And then you have um, all my plants over there, all the girls and boys. You know, you see them? And then, let's not get started with this section. That's right. You see how beautiful they look? And they just growing lovely. And the growth season is coming back. Now, I don't really um, do too much talking about my plants because those are my kids and I kind of keep it personal. But I'm going to give you all a talk about them one day. I might as well. I've actually taken some pictures of my plants and, you know, it works out. Um, give me a second. Kind of get get cold, you know. Now, I want you to watch me eat. Okay, ain't that kind of channel? Um, I've seen some YouTube channels, and I'm not knocking anybody to each his own. But there's certain people when I see uh, those YouTube channels and the way they are over food, they're not even obese. They're just people. The way they act over food, that's just that's, that's not me. But I'm not knocking anybody to each, each his own. More power to you. Um, but anyway, listen, I'm going to go ahead and knock this out, and then I'm, I'm going to rest. I hurt my back yesterday doing this workout, so I might need to rest it. I'm thinking about popping some naproxens. I'm not really sure. I don't like taking medicine. Uh, I'd really rather do natural things like ginger and turmeric. So hopefully, let's see what happens. Um, and then I have to get outside. So I'm not going to cut this video just yet. This is, I'm going to probably take y'all outside with me. I have to go for a walk, and I have to go to the bank. and I may take y'all with me. I'm not really sure. So hold on for a second. Let me finish this video. Let me wrap this up. You, you, you know why I'm upset? I'm in the car. Okay? I'm with Mr. Grumpy. As we call him on camera. I'm sitting there. You ever be talking to your kid, right? And you're talking to him. And then all of a sudden, those things right there, stuck to their ears. That's what, you know, you sit there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cause of the thing. And when we go there, da, 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 da. and next thing you know, they turn to you. And they give you this puzzled look, wondering why your lips is moving. So they text, press pause on their, on, on their, on their screens. And suddenly you realize for the last 20 minutes, you've been talking to yourself. Makes perfect sense, right? I know I'm not the only one. So now I'm ready to take a phone and chuck it right out the window. I pay for that phone. And yet, I can't get a conversation in. Anyway, yo, listen. I enjoyed the duck. I'll be posting that soon. Uh... I can't even think straight. I want to snuff him, but in front of the, the person driving the car, that might be uh, not inappropriate. Anyway, we had to get some clothes. That boy needs some clothes. He, he riding a friend of mine's car. So, we got to head over to Foreman Mills and grab some stuff. Because Foreman Mills, they got some decent stuff for cheap prices. So, sometimes when you need some get up and go stuff, you know, you don't you, know, you can take a hundred bucks there and you can come out with a couple of outfits. Just something to, just to get you by until... You can get somewhere else to get some better quality. So anyway, uh, y'all people stay tuned, man. I got some new stuff coming. This is a really weird video. I do have my camera on, and I have no intention of taking no pictures on it today. But I may come across something. If I do, I will turn back on the camera. Now I might not end this video just yet, just because I may show y'all what I'm doing in Formula Mills. But anyway, right now I gotta go. Sorry, I could not. I tried. I could not take a video inside Foreman Mills. First and foremost, it was tight in there. Second of all, let me tell you something. Off the rack clothes got pretty expensive. When I was a kid, you can get 17 pairs of pants for 15 cents. Now, I want $12.99 for a pair of slacks and somebody I'm probably sh sneezed on. All COVID all over the pants. Anyway, I had to give my son a pair of kicks. I call them kicks. He says, Dad, they're not called kicks anymore. They call sneakers. Whatever. Anyway. We had over to an old school spot of mine. They, put, they always had official footwear, so we're gonna go check them out. They're called VIMs, that's right. I might go in no Foot Locker and pay $25 more than I have to. VIMs always had quality footwear. We grew up with VIMs. So if they got something decent, we're gonna get it. If not, we're gonna buy it offline. I'll tell you all, this is new. Back here by Westchester, crazy. Westchester Avenue, not Westchester Square. So, we walking. 
me and this dude here who just cost me two hundred and seventy dollars. Well, about two hundred twenty. No, I ain't got it like that. I promise you. I had to go out here for two weeks and ask people for money just to get up enough money for him. I wish that was true because then it would be some free stuff. No, I had to work hard for it. Anyway, so uh, sun is setting. I got a meeting tonight, so I got to hurry up and get home. Uh, anyway, everybody back here is going to be wild enough. So I'm going to have to let y'all go because if somebody act a fool, this king going to be for more than walking. Y'all take care. That's a big dog, yo. And he's losing his mind. You want to see him? If he start chasing me, I'm blaming everybody on YouTube. Because he got a nasty attitude. She can't even control him. She's going to beat the dog in the street. See that? He's sitting there biting that toy out of frustration. That's crazy. That's crazy. That dog got a true toy. Preparing to bite your and my thigh. Enoughproblem.com. Anyway, um, I was I had that back here the other day. Told me how everything has changed, so I had to come through here again. And so that's the hangout corner over there. They over there doing something wrong. The man got his pants down. Anyway, let me put y'all away for a second. Cause the last thing in the world I need is problem. See him? Awesome. <laughs> oh, hold on. I am not sponsoring anything. No copyrights, no pictures, no comments. I don't know what he's doing. But uh, they doing something. So, we heading over to our store. And I'll tell you, we in the heart of South Bronx. I used to be the old jam, South Bronx, South South Bronx. That was a good jam there. Um, so I gotta pay my rent. That's never fun. You know, you, you, I always find it difficult to hand a man a lot of cash and say, "Here, this is for me to have a place to stay." But you gotta do it. It's called being responsible. Uh, I'm not taking any pictures today. I thought I was going to, until my son dissed me. Yo, Dad, my back hurt. So, no pictures today. Uh, the only workout I'm doing today is just walking because my back hurts from the other day still. So, I'm taking it easy. Hopefully by tomorrow, I'll be back at it. You good back there, man? Are you gonna throw up yet? Guy, only guy I know who go since he was a kid. Low guy. He gets motion sickness. We in the car. Now I, I mean I got issues with cars too to a certain degree, but this guy always acting a little sick. For hours too. He was sick for hours. Man, what's wrong with you? Anyway, I'm gonna wrap up this video here, guys. Honestly, I'm not taking guy for me to VIM. Um that's if they even open. The other day, I uh, I thought the other side of this was open, and then I was sadly mistaken because it wasn't. It was closed. I had to walk back. Y'all remember, right? Yo, shish kebabs always smell good, but not everybody can make a good one. That lamb be smelling real, real tasty. Anyway, um, yeah. No. So, I'm about to wrap this video up, guys. Anyway, uh, there are people in front of me, behind me, on the side of me. Everybody looking at me crazy. Everybody's doing YouTube nowadays, so what are you going to do? Anyway, this is the last part of the video. Y'all stay tuned.